Hey guys, it's General Heat here again, and today um, we're filming another um, kind of a test video for that Samsung Gear 360 camera. Um, but gonna make it a little bit more interesting today, and I'm gonna be doing a behind-the-scenes video um, for how me at Go Team Productions basically um, records the videos, as well as partially how to find our glitches. Because, you know, a lot of people have been asking for that for a while. So, uh, let's get started. So, right now, as you can see here, this is basically um, my basement. And, um, you know, it's, I don't want to say like production studio, but it kind of is my production studio for uh, a few years. Um, it's going to be changing soon because I'll be graduating college. And, uh, you know, things might be moved around and so on. Um... But anyways, so yeah, this is the production studio I've been using <laughs> since my very first videos. Um, in fact, uh, if you turn around and stop facing me, like, you know, just look behind you, you know, turn around. That's right, turn around and look over there. Um, this is basically my, uh, my recording setup. So. Now, nine years ago, uh, when I first started this, I had like a I had a box TV there <laughs> for the uh, 360. Uh, that has obviously since been replaced with a flat screen TV. But um, aside from that, the original setup is still there actually. So if you look over there where my Xbox 360 is, that is indeed the same 360 where I recorded most of my Halo 3 videos from the past. Um, but People have asked me what I record with back then. Well, if you look right under the 360, what it's sitting on top of, that thing right there. So if you're still looking at me, you should really turn around now. Um, that is a light-on DVD recorder. It was meant to record like VHS tapes to convert them to DVDs, uh, you know, for like saving like you know longer term and stuff. But I found out I could also use it to record. Um, gameplay footage from my 360 and you know for several several years that is what I use to record my videos it records everything to like a DVD disc which I would have to extract later on my PC it was kind of like a inconvenient process but you know it's what I had and it worked pretty well for the past like I don't know seven or eight years and it doesn't work too well anymore now I've pretty much worn it out a lot but you know that little machine down there got me, got my YouTube channel going, and it worked really well. But now that I have the Xbox One that's sitting right on top of it as well, um, I now don't need a DVD recorder anymore to record. Uh, certainly, the quality is no longer as good because it's DVD quality versus um, I think it's 720p that the um, the game DVR records at. Uh, yeah, something like that. But yeah, so. I'm gonna put you guys back down. You could turn back around if you want. Um, let me set you down. There we go. So, I'm gonna show you the process at which we um, record our videos, and a little bit of how to f how we find our glitches. But you know, that's more of a big experiment thing. So sometimes it could take hours to find something. Most of the time, it just happens randomly. Uh, so, without further ado, let's get started. Xbox on. Haha, <laughs> yeah. I actually do use the connect voice commands. <laughs> and they said it was useless. <laughs> Anyways. Uh, so, the first step is... Um, I need to find someone to help me out with. So, let's browse my friends list. Who will help me? Uh, wow, I actually don't have that many people on right now. Um, hmm. Let's try this person. Good old general lead. He has been in a video for a while, but see if you'll join for this one. If not, I'll have to find someone else. 
And worst case scenario, if I don't find anyone, then, well, gonna do by myself. But this particular glitch I'm working on today that I found a couple of days ago, or actually yesterday, um, probably easier with like two people, um, you know, just because. But, um, yeah. Actually, by the time you're watching this, uh, if, you know, if you're not on the first day watching this, then that glitch video has probably already been uploaded. So, at least you can see a little bit of the, you know, the making of, I guess. All right, on to the next option. Come on, nobody's joining. Really? Well, you know, if you don't want to stare at the screen the whole time, feel free to have a look around at my lair. <laughs> sort of. Basically, like, I don't know, all the junk in my house, we just, like, toss down here, basically. Uh, yeah. <clears throat> joining. Yo, what's up? Hey, can you hear me? Okay, perfect. Um, you want to come on, um, okay. Okay. okay I need help with a, uh, potential video. Alright, so, um, we actually just took like oh, an hour and a half to finally find the glitch, but, um, so now that we found it, um, depending on, like, the difficulty of the glitch, um, I may just record it live, like, you know, in-game, but if it's, um, if it's too hard, or if it's something that, like, takes several tries, and I don't know if I'll get on the first try, I'll, I'll do it in, uh, campaign or gameplay, and then I'll go to theater mode, <clears throat> and then record it that way. So what I record with is what a lot of people ask me and it's quite simple. All I use is the game DVR. So, you know, I'm gonna snap it right now. There we go, game DVR. And <clears throat> let me get it to record. And let's do this. So, <clears throat> I'm gonna start the clip first. <clears throat> See, theater mode in Halo is great, especially Halo 3. I, I really love the feature. It probably so many glitches of mine are were found thanks to theater mode. Some of them they just happen like instantly, and like you know gone and if I missed it then you know it's gone forever probably the theater mode saves it so usually what I gotta do is I gotta fast forward to a lot of theater mode so I get to the point I will I will skip ahead in a second but I do want to point out there's one issue with the theater mode on the MCC the Master Chief Collection and it's that I don't know if you can see the screen clearly or not but the time bar that tells me like where I am in the entire clip, like what time it is, and how much time is left, it doesn't show up anymore on the MCC. You know, be it campaign or multiplayer, Forge custom games, it's gone. And that's like really annoying because like I can kind of remember where, when um, the glitch happened, but. I, I just don't know exactly where, and I'm afraid like if I fast forward, I'll fast forward past it. And in campaign, you can't you can't rewind. So if I miss it, especially if it's a long campaign mission, a long clip, if I if I fast forward past it, I have to restart the entire thing again. And I I don't know like you know 
timing, so just gotta be careful, basically on MCC. <clears throat> All right, so <clears throat> I believe I got to the part where um, the glitch occurs. So hopefully this is the one, and not have to end the clip and try again. But so let's start recording. So I'm gonna do switch back to the game DVR. Start recording. Switch back to the game and resume. Here we go. Uh, it took so many tries to get this, so I don't know if this was the correct one or not. Maybe it was. Alright, so throw a power drain there. Yeah, this is the one. So there you have it. That's uh, the first part of the recording with the clip. And now I can stop the recording. That clip will automatically upload to um, my Xbox Live Cloud, which I can then retrieve on my uh, PC on my Windows 10 computer using the Xbox app. It's, it's really easy. You just download your captures, and that's all there is to it. Uh, then once you download your clips, you can edit it however you want with whatever software you want. Um, in my case, I actually still use Windows Movie Maker, the newest version, of course, but yeah, for, for simple glitch videos, I use Windows Movie Maker. For more complex videos, like this video in particular, that you're watching right now, I use something like Adobe Premiere, because only Adobe Premiere, that I have at least, um, can edit these virtual reality videos. <clears throat> Anyways, um, I recorded multiple clips, so... I'm going to proceed to record uh, the last one. Fortunately, this one did not take as long, but yeah, so it's going to be the same process, you know, rinse and repeat, fast forward to the part, um, and then record. So, you know, I don't, I don't need to show you guys this again. You get the gist, I think. Um, <clears throat> so, it's going to end the clip here now, and for this particular uh, glitch video, uh, look forward to it very soon, uh, if it's not up already. So, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this behind the scenes video. Um, you know, feel free to have one last look around. One last one. And, yeah. Uh, if you like this video, um, I'm going to see if I can make some more in the future with this. Uh, it's a very interesting piece of little technology here. But, um, <clears throat> you know, let's... Uh, Drop a like if you enjoyed this, and uh, remember to subscribe as well if you haven't already, and I will see you guys next time. Bye. Let me wait behind you if you're staring behind. Bye. So, yeah. See ya.